Hey everyone, this is Tony Reeves and this is Reeves Point of View. Today we're going to talk about understanding your legal settlement. Okay, this is typically how it works. You're in a type of litigation case, and if you have an attorney, your attorney's probably already explained this to you, but I'm, so I'm just giving you a generalization of something that you should probably know. But at some particular point during some type of litigation process, you're gonna be offered what you may be offered an opportunity to settle the case. Now, what you're gonna hear people say all the time is, a settlement invariably means both sides are unhappy because both sides are typically going to give up something that they otherwise would not have wanted to. Meaning not everybody gets what they want, not everybody gives up what they want. So both sides are angry. You'll hear mediators often say, that means the settlement's good because both sides gave up something that they didn't want to give up and both sides are probably mad because they didn't think they got everything they wanted. That's the way it typically goes. However, settlements can be kind of wonky. So it's really important that you understand that merely getting, like let's say the settlement is for a dollar amount, sometimes the dollar amount is not that clean. So there's a few things you need to be aware of. First, make sure that you understand all the provisions of the, of the settlement, which usually includes a lot of particular language about what you cannot do after the fact. It may indicate that you can't sue them for whatever happened or that arose under the certain facts. It may indicate that you can't say anything bad about them, depending on the case itself. If it's an employment situation, it may be that the employer has to give you some type of reference, usually a neutral reference, and they can't disparage you. So what you want to do is you want to make sure when you're looking through it, you see exactly what it says you can and you can't do. Also, how is the money categorized? Remember, if they're giving this to you in terms of wages, like back wages or anything like that, that may be money that you may be responsible for for tax purposes. That's another thing that's often in the settlement agreement is that it outlines that you may be responsible for taking the taxes out. So they're giving you dollar amount, they're just giving you the dollar, but they're not responsible for pulling out any taxes. That's on you. So you wanna make sure you're aware of that as well. It's important to also understand that in most settlements, it is never an admission of, of a particular act. So if you're suing them because of a slip and fall, you're suing them because of wrongful termination, Settlement typically indicates this is not an admission of anything. This is basically their way of, okay, you go your way and I go mine. So make sure you understand that going in. Also, and most importantly, read it, understand it, make sure you get people to explain to you if you don't understand what you're reading. Because a lot of times what happens, people, they're so in so much of a rush to get the money or to sign off and get it, that they don't realize that there are aspects of it that may have an impact on them going forward. Whether they be non-disclosure agreements where you're not allowed to talk about it for a period of time, whether it be certain, maybe the monies that you're gonna get may not come to you all at once, it may come to you in installments. Get an understanding and make sure when you, especially if you have an attorney in this case, which you probably do, ask them as many questions as possible because when you sign off on that thing, you wanna make sure you have a complete understanding of exactly what you're getting and what you're giving up. Hey everyone, this is Tony Reeves. If you like my content or have any suggestions, please let me know and by all means, make sure you share. The only way I can get my word out is you help me get the word out as well.